All right, here we go, everybody. Uh, the big news is uh, no news. I gather that could be big news. Uh, we are in the tropical season now, but 85 degrees for a high, well above normal, three degrees for the month. We've hit 90 degrees 12 times for the month. And you can see, again, 81 degrees, 90 degrees up Newburgh. My man crew is on it with some impressive numbers for the dew point. It's right now oppressive, okay? That's what it feels like, the measure of humidity. Now, the temperature is one thing, and the humidity is another and the combo is rough so you can see for tomorrow's heat index prefrontal right around 91 degrees and then the front's going to go by maybe a scattered shower and we'll cool it down okay this is the heat index for tomorrow you can see it from Crawford up to Albany that's upstate and Lee the Lakes from Rochester to uh, Burton and again you can see this prefrontal squeeze now this is the leading edge of the cold front you can see this stripe trying to line up with a severe thunderstorm watch in effect and that's going to begin to progress in our direction. And you can see what happens. Uh, the axis goes north. That's one. Then the front begins to take a real nice shot at night. And then it kind of gives us a period of rain. This is the latest uh, rapid precision model, but not an outstanding long period of rain. But let's hope for whatever we can get because we need rain around here. We're down four to five inches in the city, more in Newark, eight to nine inches. Marginal risk for thunderstorms, though the line seems to be getting closer. The U.S. Open is tonight, first night. And, of course, the big headline is going to be Serena and the crowd. And temperatures will be in the 70s. and It'll be good. Now, the beach boating forecast is real good. The water temperature is 76. The UV index is 7. Here we go. It's a drought. So what happens when you get a drought? You get dry. And you get a pouring forecast. That's boring, not pouring. But we can use some pouring uh, tomorrow late afternoon night, right? Let's root for that. Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, we're going to cool it down, lower humidity. And right now, ladies, it looks like right into Labor Day, we're going to be in good shape weather-wise.